open beautiful to some clowns. They can be hilarious, yeah. but also terrifying. Yeah, uh, same with Molly. She's hilarious and sometimes she's terrifying. She's live at a haunted house with some funny business going on. Hey, welcome to Clown Town. That's right. Oh, shit. They didn't tell me they were going to do that. Hey, wait, you guys, look, there's a rainbow. How funny is that? I love it. Okay, a good little sign of peace as we enter through Clown Town. So this is a haunted house in Citrus Heights. It's someone's real home. Every year, they go all out. We've got Michelle here, the owner, and Tracy, uh, Tracy Ketchum, executive producer, who does not like clowns. I know that you're maybe watching like this. Right. I just want you to Probably. look really quickly. Someone did want to say hello, okay? <laughs> There he is. Hello. Oh my God. Hello. Hello. <laughs> they got me for <laughs> She said, What are you doing? Yeah. <laughs> this is some serious funny business. Uh, Michelle, you and your husband, Double Steve, box. you go all out every year. Uh, you welcome people Saturdays in October and then Halloween's the big night, of course. Of course. Yeah, we go, we will be out here on Saturdays in character, running around, having a good time. And then on Halloween, big time, we have, we're out here big time Halloween, so. Big time Halloween, the candy and everything. And if you look around, I mean, uh, photographer Scott and I were just saying, everywhere we look, there's something to notice different. You, uh, there's so many details. Jeez. <laughs> You guys missed, sorry, he jumped out at me. That's Steve. Oh, gosh, okay. <laughs> the element of surprise, everyone. Uh, you make a lot of the masks. Like, a lot of these are completely homemade by you guys. Yes. Like, this one up here, this one's, this one's homemade here. And then, uh, th I mean, each year you go bigger and bigger. better and funnier. We have to outdo ourselves every year, you know, so yeah. we have to go a little bit bigger every time. So, yeah, we try to do new stuff every year. It's all clowns, but there's a lot of the same ones, but they're new ones, too. So. And if you think what you're seeing right now is a lot, Steve takes the last week of October off of work just so he can finalize all the details. I want to show you something really quickly, you guys. Uh, they also make, this is how crafty they are, they make these uh, fire pits. Fire they're fire pits if you take a dirt flame log and put a piece of one in there and then light it it's it's really cool it looks like a pumpkin with a flame in it so yeah or you can just put a candle or just a light in it too and so if you come out here schooner way in citrus heights uh they'll be selling them now let's walk over here of course when with a house like this you have to ask what do the neighbors think and michelle told me they love it in fact they're starting to get into it too as you can see across the way uh so here's the thing, you guys. I think you know that I'm a little squeamish, that I get kind of afraid. Haunted houses are not my thing, but clowns, for some reason, do not scare me. And in fact, Court, I think you have a picture. I actually loved clowns growing up. So oh, wait, here's a little proof that? of that, if you can. Ah, oh, bye. Oh, there, there it is. Are, there is you are. <laughs> now we see there it. There it is. That's little Molly. Uh, so yeah, you could say that I've been in uh, the business of funny business for quite a while. Uh, this house though, uh, clearly as Steve popped out, I am a little squeamish when it comes to people jumping out at me. Uh, but Michelle, so again, you're welcoming people every Sunday, it's Saturday night in October and then Halloween, you give out the candy. Yes, on sa Saturdays we'll be out here having a good time. So come on by and check it out. And then on Halloween, of course, come by and get some candy. Okay, you guys, here's my only advice, though. Don't eat too much candy. It might make oh. you sick. Oh, oh my God. <laughs> That's amazing. That is so disturbing and mommy, awesome all at the same time. My tummy doesn't feel good. <laughs> also, love that the neighbors are getting into it. Maybe Tracy Ketchum could move next door. Yeah. And this will leave her uh, fear of clowns. Yeah, it's, it's, it's what they call exposure therapy. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah. Tracy, I'm curious what you so. think is worse, clowns or a barking clown? Which one freaks you out more? <laughs> or half a clown. Yeah, half a clown. I'm going to get a text. Molly! <laughs> <laughs> Molly! Oh, man. I, I've Molly. seen that exact scene leading the Fresno State football game. <laughs> and it's homecoming weekend yeah. for a lot of schools. Yeah. So yeah. You might see that. Uh -huh. Thank you, Molly. Thank you, Molly. Oh, there's a oh, clown. Wait, wait, wait. Never mind. You're fine. <laughs> 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 By the way, Tracy Ketchum also thanks you for wrapping it up. Oh, man. Oh, thank Good you, Molly. Stuff.